There's no way the US can crush us. The world needs Huawei because we are more advanced. Even if they persuade more countries not to use us temporarily, we could just scale things down a bit. And because the US keeps targeting us and finding fault with us, it has forced us to improve our products and services. What kind of impact would it have on your business if the US is successful in getting many of its partners in the West to shut your equipment out? If the lights go out in the West, the East will still shine. And if the North goes dark, then there is still the South. America doesn't represent the world. How important is the future of Huawei in the UK with regards to your investment plans and jobs? Are you, are you able to guarantee that you will not be pulling out of the UK, you will not be taking jobs out of the UK? We will continue to invest in the UK. We still trust in the UK, and we hope that the UK will trust us even more. We will invest even more in the UK, because if the US doesn't trust us, then we will shift our investment from the US to the UK on an even bigger scale. Uh, Mr. Ren, I would like to uh, raise the issue of your daughter. This is a personally very, very challenging time for you. Uh, she is in Canada. She's been arrested uh, by the U.S.'s request and she faces extradition. How do you feel about this and what will you do if she is sent to jail? I object to what the U.S. has done. This kind of politically motivated act is not acceptable. The U.S. likes to sanction others whenever there's an issue. They'll use such methods. We object to this. There's no impact on Huawei's business due to Meng Wangzhou's loss of freedom. In fact, we're growing even faster. So they caught Meng Wangzhou. Maybe they got the wrong person. They may have thought if they've arrested her, Huawei would fall. But we didn't fall. We are still moving forward. Our company has established processes and procedures and no longer relies on any one person. Even if I myself go one day, this company won't change its trajectory forward.